the Society of Motion Picture and Television Engineers. Marge had a little chat with the folks at TV Pro Gear. Today at this is our um, universal fly pack. Uh, it was, has three patents on it applied. Uh, the monitor goes up and down for shipment electrically. Is this a portable studio? It's an entire studio on wheels. Okay. Um, MTV has one. They shot 32 concerts with it last year. Warner Brothers is using it for sports, football, basketball, and <clears throat> smaller markets. Comcast has one. We shipped one of these to Libya recently, the U and they've ordered seven more for the university systems to interconnect all the universities so they can videotape the lectures and send it over IP uh, from this. We also make a version of this with an H.264 encoder so you can webcast. So I actually was involved in production many years ago, and I remember the old van. Uh, how, how does this equipment different from I think at that point it was still beta tapes that, that I was yeah. using with a portable van. So the fly pack sl slides into this truck. We make this truck, um, we have it outside, so you, so you can actually roll the fly pack into the truck and it snaps into place. Then you have satellite for up, up and down like you, using the new VSAT, which is only $30 an hour. Okay. It has global position, you can automatically catch the satellite and you don't have to steer it in. And of course, it gives you uh, up can, um, instant replay in slow motion for sports. Oh, okay. But so it is. It can be used as a truck inside the truck, or you could take it out. Like okay. so, two boxes. The companion box holds the cameras, the um, ca the uh, cable reels, the tripods, the headsets, the mics. So two boxes, and you can go anywhere in the world. It takes less than 15 minutes to set up and be ready to shoot. There's two types of shoots. There are single camera shoots, which is typically the scripted material or documentary, and then there's multi-camera shoots, which are typically non-scripted event type things like concerts, uh, conferences, music concerts, sports. So this is used for those type of things where a multi-camera system is required, and it enables you to cut from camera to camera, of course, to dissolve, wipe, uh, picture in picture, you can do in high-end graphics, you can make titles, um, you can record and store clips for playback. So if you're doing a, uh, for example, doing a seminar and the speaker wants to have images playing back on the projector, it can feed the projector at the same time they're shooting. So it's a universal production system. It's designed to take up to eight cameras, either people-operated or robotic. Um, it has um, four channels of wireless Sennheiser microphones, a 12-input uh, HD-SDI switcher, uh, multi-viewer. You can pull the power cord from it and it'll run for over an hour on battery backup. It shoots in both NTSC and PAL and also in every format on frame rate in HD, so it's completely universal. It has frame synchronizers, up converters, down converters, cross converters, and aspect ratio converters built in. So on the back of it, there's outputs for anything. So if you need to feed any kind of projector or object, it can feed it out or take it in. Now that's a tool that production tech tips could use. Marge said she'd have a talk with someone about that. 